Day two. This is the 549 serial number. Last night I, uh, the engine does turn over and last night I put automatic transmission fluid down the uh, cylinder and uh, it turns over tight, but the recoil recoils perfectly. So I don't think it's the piston or anything that's stuck or anything. I think it might be the rotary valve that's inside of these. That might be the difficult part and it just needs good lubrication to turn. But at this point I'm unsure. But this easily sat in a barn for over 30 years. It could have been uh, the last time it ran, according to the spark plug. I mean, it has in it. From what I was told, it uh, that spark plug was last made in the 60s. So, it could have been the 60s this last time this one ran. Who knows? But as you see it is as it sat. Nobody has messed with the transmission turning or anything. I'm, I am kind of curious if that could be the cause of why it's hard to turn over, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't know why. So we'll dig into it here and see if we can find out. Take out the air cleaner. Of course, the primer is. Sorry about my camera skills there. Primer is stuck down. So, we'll get into it here and figure out what's going on, why she's being so stubborn. You hear my daughter there, but, alright, this was stuck, not sure why, but turns over and turns over great, no spark plug in it, so. Got a bunch of lube I put down the uh, carburetor and knowing the direction thing go got it circulate so we're going to turn this over for a little bit to get stuff out and then we'll check for some spark here put a little prime downer if it has ignition if not we got to take this cover off because that's where the points are located later on they put them external where you didn't have to take that off to do anything which was nice so alrighty, that's a good positive there so we get this mess here and everything going and whatnot and I'll show you how clean this air filter is. It is. It doesn't look like it's got a day of... Sorry about that. <laughs> about to drop the camera, but this is uh, absolutely clean inside out. Doesn't look like it has a day of use on it. So, that's good. A lot of nasty stuff coming out of there, but it's flushing out. How about for fun, we see if she has spark. Hell yeah, she does. Well, you guys can see it, but it's there. Sunlight's kind of interfering. There we go. I think you guys saw it. We've got ignition. So, I wonder. Keep flushing her out real good. Put a little fuel down her and see if she wants to fire or, or what. Yeah, the handle's pretty much turning back into crude oil. Turning a mush on me. Alrighty. I'm still curious as to what that was for, but we'll leave it there for the moment. Well, nothing else is coming out of the cylinder. Great spark. How about you say we put a little prime fuel down the spark plug and uh, see if she'll pop over for us. Here's the whole thing, eh? Here we have it. She breathes life. I figured you guys want to see the smoke show. The smoke show? Yes, baby girl. Yes. You shouldn't be around this stuff anyways when it's going. I
How you guys like that one? All right, well, she's a runner. Like I said, thanks for watching. We'll look at the other one whenever we figure out a starter situation for it in there. So, if you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe. We're going to have more of these. Until then, thanks for watching.